I want you to guess what happens when I get detected by this woman. Check the sieve. If you guessed nobody will care, then congratulations, you are 100% correct. This is the start of a bit of an investigation into uh, how detection works with civilians and shouting at them and stuff like that. But let me just show you what happens when this woman walks past her. She finally becomes alerted and then it begins to cascade out. So, if you thought that was crazy, let me show you something even crazier. The plans we stole Let's see the vault is between place. the ground and upper floors. You'll need to find a way up there. I think it goes without saying that detection in this game is a little bit weird. So, best I can tell, what's happening here is civilians and guards you know how when they see you they have the detection meter and it goes up faster if you're close to them and it goes up slower if you're far away from them i think the same thing is happening here where if a civilian is looking at a panicked civilian they will slowly start increasing their detection meter based on how close they are to that civilian but obviously this is invisible so you can't see it you don't know what's happening and to us it looks like nothing is happening and everyone's just ignoring this panicked man in, in the corner of the room which looks really goofy it seems really stupid uh and eventually people do get alerted but because they're quite far away it takes ages this has some weird implications for gameplay as well because, and this is kind of the main topic of this video that I want to stick on for a bit, or not really stick on, but it's the main takeaway of this video, there are situations where it's better God. to avoid shouting at a civilian than it is to just leave them standing there panicked. Because when you shout at a civilian, everybody that sees them instantly becomes alerted. They will instantly run over to them and investigate. And if it's a guard, they will instantly call the police. Oh, if it's a civilian, I think they will call for a guard to come and investigate. And that maybe isn't what you want in certain situations. For example, if a guard is looking towards a panicked civilian, if you shout at them, the guard will instantly go over and investigate. Whereas if you leave the civilian panicking for like five seconds, maybe the guard will walk away before he notices. It's really dumb. On the screen right now there will be an example of this kind of thing where making them lie down, which you can also do by meleeing them, not just shouting at them, um, but if you make them lie down they will instantly get detected by everything. Uh, in this case I'm using a camera because it's really hard to set up and it's a camera. Uh, create a scenario where I can easily show this uh, because it's not something that happens all the time and it's really hard to get footage of but this is the best i could do um and you can quite clearly see that when the civilian lies down it instantly starts getting detected um if i just leave the civilian standing there the camera doesn't give a shit and this is possibly another use case for this if there's a camera looking at a civilian that's detected you just leave them for like a few seconds and wait for the camera to turn around. Next up I just have some quick rock the cradle footage because I've just got some extra footage while recording this uh, where you can see it takes about five seconds after flirting the bartender for other people in the room to notice that he's panicked. And also a little bit of a use case for meleeing civilians to get them down. Um, it turns out that it's instant so you can use this to force people to instantly get on the ground without anyone else noticing them. 